guys, Street Booth Killer B Guy here. We're at the scene. Uh, we're trying to get this orchestrated so we can get inside. Hey, buddy. Hey, how are you? Uh, coming around. Hi, Mike. Mike, I'm Reed. Nice to meet you. Good to meet you. Yeah, I'm Killer B Guy. Nice. Oh, so man. They're doing? already lighting up. They're already back uh, being aggressive. Okay. And so, um, Trish, you know, community yeah, officer, I know, I she, know Trish. Mm -hmm. yeah, she went around the corner to warn that guy to have him get his dog in because. Uh, they've already stung. Were you guys on yesterday when they attacked? No. I heard about it though. Yeah. A nightmare is what it is. And so, <coughs> we're trying to prevent that. <clears throat> again, and again, and again. Sure. Because once they've attacked, and that pheromone's in the air, they'll stay mad for up to two weeks. Oh, nice. I mean, they've chased that truck for ten miles. Wow. After a bad removal. Mm -hmm. And they're, of course, just as, I don't know, if, you know, what you guys know about these damn things, but they're all Africanized. Yeah. In the States. Done deal. Every week in this county in the summer, they kill a dog, a horse, or a goat. They're evil. Hell, they killed Dan Oldfield and Bisbee, for God's sake, a couple of years ago. And so, yesterday, of course, there were, we don't even know how many people were stung. Everyone we talked to on that street this morning was stung. They were stinging in at least a one block, possibly two block radius. Two people in the hospital that we knew of. So, what we're doing now is hurry up and wait. We're, um, we gotta get a key, we gotta get inside. But what they're, the bees are up in the roof line, halfway down the alley. Okay. Someone was trimming bushes or some damn thing back there. And they got riled up, of course. We don't know who was monkeying around back there and we don't really care. We put a police tape on either side of the alley so that uh, hopefully a kid won't walk down there. Because yeah. we haven't done anything except located them. Okay. And from 20 feet away, they started coming out. And that was a couple hours ago when it was nice and cool. Okay. Now it's warming up and they just chased Trish. Well, well, that's not Trish. They just, oh yeah, it is. They just traced her back in her vehicle. Okay, sitting so once, here. once we get a key, how are we helping you? Um, basically, um, it's standing at, e or some, at, at one end or both ends of the alley, because that's the primary point of access. Okay. All the neighbors will be already warned to stay inside and keep the animals in, but it's keeping people from looking loose. Okay. Looking loose, because they will sure as shit. We can be in bee suits, angry bees everywhere, police tape up and go, what are you doing? We know. <laughs> yeah, we know. Yeah, no, it's, a, it's not usually bees that we're dealing with. Yeah, there's got... one on me right now, yeah. those fuckers. Do you need like a hose line in place or anything? You know, like it's a good or... idea in case you need to hose us down. Now, the plan of attack with this, once we get inside, I believe they could be hanging off of the ceiling. There's probably a false ceiling in there. Um, we need to seal up their outside entrance because that's where that's where they're going to come pouring out again. Okay. All right. And I've seen the air so saturated with the tax pheromone, they're sticking birds flying overhead, telephone poles, and tires on trucks. They're evil little that's bastards. Step one for you? Huh? Is that step one is to do the outside? Yeah, okay. that's the step one. That's after we're suited up and, and uh, you guys have your turnouts and whatnot. But um, uh, seal up the outside entrance. They're still going to come up because it's 20 feet high. So we're going to have to get the ladder up. We're going to have to trim bushes to get back there. It's going to be a clusterfuck is what it's going to be. Okay. So we have to seal that up so that all 100,000 can't come out. Okay. You know, so maybe you guys only. need a ladder up there too? We have a little Titan that we can stick up there, and I think that we'll do that. And we have, uh, you know, chainsaw and stuff. We have a lot of stuff on the truck, but here, here they are. We should get back in our vehicles before they chase us back in, okay, which so they're doing. We're yeah. waiting for so a key. We're, it's a hurry up and wait right now, yeah. Okay. And then we'll go okay. inside. We'll drag everybody in, assess the situation. We have a thermal imaging cam. We'll see what the hell's going on. And, of course, we document everything we do. I don't know if you've ever seen our YouTube and TikTok and Facebook and all that shit. No, I have not. Oh, killer bee guys. Go look right now. Uh, but we swear like sailors in bee suits. <laughs>